Okay, take three. This is my third time trying to film this video. <laughs> it happens. So, yesterday, okay, in my last video that you will see, and it will be an April 4th grocery haul, I said at the end that I was done grocery shopping. But it turns out yesterday, April 5th, which was Wednesday, my father-in-law had to have surgery, and we were up in Mesa just about five minutes down the road from our discount grocery store. So my husband said, why don't we go? We're here. So uh, we went, I ran in, did a quick little shop. It was in and out in less than an hour. You know, just if you, if you haven't shopped at a discount grocery store, you gotta go through all the aisles and make sure you don't miss anything of great value. So I went and I, I did a quick one. I didn't even go into the bulk meat section because I don't have any freezer space for it and don't really need any. And I ended up spending $97.08 for my total. So my grand total for the whole month spent on groceries is $437.63. I did get some really great deals. So if you notice on the receipt up here where it says miscellaneous grocery for $19.96, well, that was an item that was supposed to be $7.99, but they didn't charge me for one of the items, so there's only a $3 discrepancy on here. And then at the bottom where it says Voucher Fiesta, that was a $2 off coupon they gave me last time that I went because I spent over $50, and whenever you spend over $50, you get to spend the prize wheel. And it goes anywhere from a dollar off up to $25 off. And I have gotten $25 off once. Gotten a few $5 and $10 off too. Mainly, most people get the $2. And then so they have a shelf of grocery items too that you can pick if it says pick an item. So, this is what I got. They have these in the clearance for 99 cents. Yes, they are hard, but that's okay. Brown sugar is easy to soften up. So I, I got two of them. There are two pound packages. The Fanta soda was $2.99, so I got a it's an eight pack of that. The cherry coke, cherry vanilla coke was $1.99 for a six pack, so I got one of those. Um, I have, let's see, the Arizona iced tea, that was, sweet tea, was 59 cents. My son, who's a musician, musician, likes to take those with him when he goes to gigs, so. And then there, like I said, there is a plethora of energy drinks. They range anywhere from 49 cents to $1.39. I get two of each for him. He can't drink a lot of coffee, so I got him those. Um, the... Jack Daniels, the 10 ounce bottle of barbecue sauce, they were 99 cents. I got two of those. Um, Silly Cow Farms Hot Chocolate. This was $2.99, I believe. Let's see. Yep, $2.99. So I got one of those. I do like to keep a can of refried beans in my pantry. These were a dollar forty-nine, and it is the thirty-ounce can. These were a dollar forty-nine. A little bit healthier as a snack. I got two of these. They were ninety-nine cents each. These were two for a dollar. The no yolk stir fry noodles. They were $1.29. I got two of those. Pastoroni, 69 cents. The Parmesan cheese one, we really like these. They were 69 cents. They only had two, so I only got two. Pop tarts. Bites. Let me think. How much were the pop tart bites? Look at my receipt here, real quick. They were. $1.99 a box. There goes that finger again. $1.99 a box. 
the Kellogg's graham cracker crumbs. There is 13.5 ounces in each box. I got two boxes. They were 99 cents each. My son likes rice cakes. These were $1.49, I believe. Um, and then they had these. They are all dented up. The date is for August of this year. And there are 52 packets all together. There are apples and cinnamon, maple brown sugar and cinnamon spice. And this was only $7.99. This is what they charged me $19.96 for. They had these a case for $7.99. It was missing two bottles. So after figuring out, the cashier figured out how much it would be per bottle versus how much it would be for the case price. The case price came out cheaper. So she was supposed to charge me $7.99 for that case. And that's what came up as $19.96. But this did not show up on my receipt for $9.99. So, there's the $3 discrepancy. Am I going to sweat it? No, I'm not. <laughs> this is three pounds of sliced Canadian bacon, and this will go great on homemade pizzas for quite a few months to come. They had these for $1.49. And the date on it is good till May 16th. And then they had these. I got two of them. They were $4.99. These are like eight bucks in my local stores. So I think I did really good on that. These make for great lunches. And sometimes we like to have them for supper. Well, you can see my daughter's kitty cat down there getting a drink of water. That's Mr. Smokey. <laughs> But that is it. That is what I got for $97.08. I'm not going to sweat the $3. So like I said, we are at a total of $437.63. Pre-pandemic, I was only paying $200 a month in groceries for my family. So, like I said in the last video, next video up is for our meal plan for the month and getting that all figured out. And then I also have um, the produce, the farmer's market that I volunteer at for the produce distribution that I will be getting fresh produce at. But I won't know what that is until like two days before. So, I will do a video on what I get. Might even be able to do a video of what goes on down there and how we do it for you. So keep saving any way you can, people. It's tough. Take care.